Hey everyone, Dale here with Pacific Sun Technologies. Today, I want to say Happy New Year. It's obviously 2020. We had a great 2019. We gained a lot of new subscribers this last year and we're thankful to have you. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Yeah, it's just right over there. Because that lets us know you enjoy what we're creating and educating you on. We focus on energy efficient home improvements mainly in the renewable energy industry like solar and batteries. Now I want to give you an idea of what you can expect from the channel this year which shouldn't come as a surprise. Battery storage solutions. There has been a lot of companies talking about entering this market and many of them have finally done it or have plans to and some have even left the battery sector. And I'll be covering all of them along with other renewable energy products making their way to homeowners. Today's video is about a company that you may already know because they've been around for over 60 years providing whole home backup to hundreds of thousands of homeowners in the United States and abroad. Generac is one of the largest generator manufacturers, well, up until mid-2019 when they acquired Pika Energy and Neria Homelink. Now, they're one of the largest battery storage manufacturers. Now, I've covered Pika Energy in previous videos comparing their technology to other solar plus storage solutions. And while they weren't as well known as the Tesla Powerwall, they were a very competitive and innovative product that we installed in 2019. This new product lineup from Generac will be dubbed PowerCell, and it lives up to that name. It's important for me to inform you about this acquisition by Generac because it means better pricing for you as the consumer if you've been holding off on a solar and battery storage system, but also means you have peace of mind with the product you purchase from us as the company has been around and is financially stable. I did mention that Generac also acquired Nereo Homelink, and this is very important because it's the monitoring solution all Generac power cells will have built into them, and it's free to customers that have a Generac power cell system installed or for those of you that already own a PICA energy system, not to worry. You can upgrade your PICA energy monitoring to the new Generac PowerView by having someone like us install some additional components. Now on a side note, Nereo Homelink also provided monitoring to Tesla Powerwall customers, nearly a hundred thousand of them. And from my understanding, Generac has no intentions on renewing the contract with Tesla as they're now a competitor and well, they own the monitoring company they were using. It's kind of funny to think that a company as large as Tesla with its vast resources was using a third party monitoring solution for their batteries rather than developing their own. It makes you wonder who else they're piggybacking off of. But that's just a side note and I want us to get back to the Generac. So there has been some changes since the acquisition of Pike Energy. Previously, the X7600 inverter under Pike Energy was capable of only 10 kilowatts of DC solar energy. Well, Generac has adjusted that to a whopping 15 kilowatts of DC power, which is a lot of solar. We're talking about 50, 300 watt modules. That's just crazy. But it's also good to know because while most of you watching will never need a system of that size, you end up with a future-proof system meaning you can add on to your solar as your energy demands change. Maybe you purchased that rad looking electric VW van or a Riven truck. You're going to need more energy for that. So while you may not need a system that large today, you may in the future. And knowing you can add on to your system with ease is very valuable. Another change is the battery storage cabinets and how many you can connect to the inverter. Pika originally had up to four full cabinets, which was 68 kilowatt hours of battery backup. But if you did this, you would use all four 30 amp inputs inside the inverter, 
leaving you no space for the solar. So Generac has decided to only allow two full cabinets for 34 kilowatt hours of battery backup, which is roughly three power walls and should be more than enough to power you through an extended power outage or peak time of use. Some things that haven't changed is the design of the system, which is amazing. I don't believe I touched on this in my previous videos, which you can find in the link below, but to be frank, I think it was due to the fact that Pika didn't really do a good job about informing me about this, which Generac made damn sure I understood that the inverter is modular. So if any issues arise, we don't need to replace the entire unit. Instead, a certified Generac specialist like Pacific Sun Technologies can replace the part inside the inverter. This keeps costs down for everyone, the manufacturer, the installer, and the homeowner, if it's out of warranty, of course. This modularity carries over to the battery cabinet too. You can install a maximum of six DCB 105 Panasonic 2.85 kilowatt hour batteries inside the cabinet. Man, that's a tongue tie. With the minimum required for the cabinet to operate being only three battery packs. This modularity is a huge advantage for consumers because you can scale your solar, sorry, you can scale your storage just like the solar. Maybe you don't need or want 34 kilowatt hours of battery power. For one, it adds to the overall cost, and for two, if you're never going to use it, why have that much? The good news is you don't have to. You can opt for an entry storage capacity of three batteries for just under 10 kilowatt hours of battery power instead to get you through time of use. This is perfect. You're not buying more than what you need or want. Plus, you can always add more. Maybe you decide you want to reserve some battery power for backup. In case of a grid outage, well, the inverter has a 50 amp critical loads breaker built right into it with an auto transfer switch. This means we can add a critical loads panel, relocate some breakers from your main service panel, and add another battery pack or two into your existing cabinet. Now your 10 kilowatt hours of batteries pack up or battery storage system is now 14.3 kilowatt hours. And you still have room to add one more battery pack in the future if you decide you need it. And this is much more cost effective when compared to other solutions like the Powerwall or SolarEdge and LG Chem setup, which only allow you to increase your storage capacity by adding an entire battery bank. I know you Tesla fanboys are watching and you're going to defend the Powerwall. And I understand the Powerwall provides 13 and a half kilowatt hours per battery, but you're missing the point I'm trying to make. This system is fully modular. So if a Tesla Powerwall owner wants to add just three kilowatt hours, more to their existing system, they can't. They have to add an entire 13 and a half kilowatt hours rather than just increasing in small increments, which is much more cost effective. Plus, when your Powerwall battery is dead by means of not holding a charge, you have to replace the entire unit rather than a single battery pack inside the unit. Generax power cell cabinet can house six Panasonic packs which, mind you, are similar in chemistry to the power wall. So if one of the packs goes bad, you don't need to replace everything, just the one bad battery. This approach makes a lot of sense. And if Generac decided to offer another battery of their own that has a larger storage capacity, they could, in theory, design it to fit in the current power cell cabinets. So thinking long term, Generac could provide higher power output batteries that fit inside the existing cabinets so customers can upgrade their storage capacity without buying a bunch of extra components. And that's of course when the batteries degrade. We'll see how this pans out long term, but I feel Generac is going to be a big player in the solar plus storage market in years to come. The technology and innovation behind this DC coupled solution is remarkable. And you can't deny that. There isn't a single manufacturer on the market right now offering a solar plus storage solution as robust as Generac. Trust me, I'm going to be talking about all of them this year. So be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Plus, let's not forget, now they're a generator manufacturer and they have plans to integrate residential generators 
into their power cell system. So you have the trifecta of energy independence, solar power, battery power, and generator power. But I got off topic a little bit. So let's get back to the power cell. So you know the inverter controls everything. It's modular for easy repair. You have the battery cabinet that houses up to six Panasonic batteries currently, providing 17.1 kilowatt hours of storage capacity, which is also modular. What you might not know is that the system also offers substring optimization. And this is probably something you may have not heard about before, but it's kind of like solar edges module level optimization, except in a string of solar panels. So typically an optimizer is being attached to each panel, but substring optimizers are attached to several solar panels up to seven for the Generac PV link, depending on the wattage and voltage of the panels. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of this. I hope Generac develops a module level optimizer as I find this much easier to design from an installer standpoint because under the new NEC code of rep for rapid shutdown, we have to install additional devices which become a pain for contractors like ourselves. But it won't affect you as the consumer or your solar production or system monitoring or maintenance for that matter. It's just a preference and I'm sure Generac will eventually have its own module level optimizer. Speaking of monitoring, I briefly touched on Nereo Homelink and this is a very important part of the entire system. Nereo is a remarkable monitoring solution and Generac did a good thing by acquiring them and integrating it into the power cell. The new branding is PowerView, which is already available for customers to check out and begin using. It provides insight into your home's energy consumption along with where you're getting your power from, whether it be the solar, batteries, or the utility grid. The system uses advanced AI to help estimate your utility costs if you're consuming too much power from the grid. It'll also learn about your energy habits and trends to ensure your battery is always topped off to provide power when you need it. You can manage every part of your solar system through the power view, which is great when a scheduled power outage is going to occur. You can simply open the app and put the system in backup mode to ensure your batteries are 100% charged. And during that power outage, you'll be able to monitor your home's consumption and see the estimated time your batteries will last if of course the sun is down. This type of monitoring is a necessity with the solar plus storage system, and it really does help you better manage your energy. All in all, I have to admit that the Generac power cell system is a well-rounded solution featuring innovative modularity, substring optimization, expandability, and user-friendly monitoring. Plus, it's an affordable solution when you really look at what you're getting. Pricing is always going to vary depending on your specific needs, but a seven kilowatt solar plus storage system with 10 kilowatt hours of battery backup should cost you around 35,000. And that's really great about Generac's approach is that installers and salespeople have to take Generac training courses and perform continuing education to sell, install, and even service the power cell. This means not every solar company is going to be able to offer it. And those that do, like Pacific Sun Technologies, have been properly trained on all aspects directly from the manufacturer. Now, if you're someone that lives here in Southern California and you're interested in a solar plus storage solution like the Generac Power Cell, then visit us online. I've provided a link in the description below. We offer four different battery solutions and we're very picky at what we offer our customers because we care about what we sell you. We're not in the business of shining and selling it. We're in the business of building lasting relationships with you, our customers, and creating a renewable future for you and families to come. And if you're someone that's out of our area, don't stress it. You can go to Generac's website to find a certified installer in your area. Generac has a great network, so you can find someone, I'm sure of it. And I provided a link in the description below for your convenience. Oh, one last thing before I go. Remember to click that little subscribe button down below and click the bell icon too so you'll receive alerts on videos just like this one. This year is going to be full of great products you're going to want to learn about. 
Thanks for watching. Until next time.